Hello there, you are welcome to Let's Talk Showbiz. And of course, today I find myself in a beautiful place in Accra. Nima, to be precise. And you know, I've been in around here, but looks like uh, today, dear, is going to be something different. I have some great artists who are working on a project together. And today I get to hang out with them, get to talk to them about music and all. Well, uh, let me actually leave them to do the introduction and then we'll get the conversation going. I've met them here and then. All right, so you are? Rena. Rena. A.K.A. Edina Bayo, A.K.A. Stepo. And you are? <laughs> hey, you don't know I said the name Urban Music representing. You see me? Straight, straight, straight. Yep, so you heard their names yeah. and, uh, well, they'll say ladies first, isn't it? That's right, ladies first. Rena, how, how has music been? How has it been treating you? Um, it's not been easy, I think, as as anything else in the world is not easy if you want something good you need to keep going for it that's why we're still here today so. okay are you Just signed good. on any record label not yet but i'm working towards that oh that yes. must really be hard yeah 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 yes yeah. <laughs> i mean can you share with me some of the challenges you go through as a female artist somebody who is trying to you know put something together for herself um i think the the very first challenge we have as females is um and i don't know this this might be controversial but it's working with men mm. dealing with men is it's something that every woman is going to complain about the very first challenge but mm. i think um generally as an artist we have issues with recording getting a studio you know getting someone to really um, invest into your crafts because recently not everybody wants to i mean focus on music and then talent women are really going through a lot we don't get um, opportunities as much as men do because mm. looking at um, I mean looking into the industry it, it feels male dominated and for a woman to be able to want to stand out to do something I think you need to do a lot of things mm. and if not God so you many can. women won't be here but yeah we give mm. thanks. I know you have done so much for yourself but let me come to Aban and then we'll come back to you Aban yeah. I know it's not been easy. The last time we probably met was somewhere in 2018. That's right. How is the grind going though? Yeah, I mean, it hasn't been easy. Like my sister here said, um, we're still we're still grinding hard. It hasn't been easy, but we still we're, we're still keeping up with the with the hard work mm. and smartness. You know. Any challenges yeah. so far? Yeah, of course. Uh, challenges I have to say um, um, comes about with promotions. Okay. And also. Um, Investments as well, you know, you know, say so this industry if you don't have the quacha uh, It's a little bit difficult to make it out there. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. that's that's a challenge so far mm. Yeah, I, I know I know you <laughs> have you have all come together to put a project together yeah. and me for me That's the most important thing that's before right. we talk about the project Let me move to Raina who right. has um, I know that she's been able in as much as you're doing everything yourself You were able to you know get into Jamaica pick out some of the best artists on there to work with them how did that happen uh, blessings and big respect i'll say to music promoters to presenters one love to king lagazi he put this together for me oh, okay. yeah, I'll, I'll also say that if i wasn't doing good for myself he won't put me into that place and um, there's so many female artists i'm um, doing their thing but if i'm not that good he mm. won't call me out to yeah put this together so king lagazi one love um, he linked me up with Chakademos and Pliers. Initially, it was just Chakademos on the song, mm -hmm. but as as I record, after I recorded, I got the song back with Pliers on it, and I'm Woo! like, "Oh man, this is so much blessings!" Yeah. yeah. So. Have you had the opportunity to meet them in person? Um, no, I met them through the air. <laughs> 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 so there, there was a first interview with um, King Lagazi, okay. and then we had to see, it was a video call, so that was like in the air scene, so I was seeing them. But um, God being so good, they put it out that we're going to have a video of that song, mm. and it's also going to be on their um, album that's going to be touring. There's Shaggy and a whole lot of people on it, so mm. I'm sure I'm going to meet them in person. Oh, so you might go on a tour with them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But how does that feel? Like, you know, knowing that you're doing everything by yourself, you're handling, meeting these people, and I mean, Lagazi getting you. How, what does this tell you as a person? It tells me not to stop doing what I'm doing. 
and keep going because if I stopped and I got lost totally, Lagazi won't find me. I was still on. That is why he put me on. So this is also out to all female artists. We shouldn't stop doing what we are doing and then yeah, we keep going. All right. And it tells me that I'm very good. <laughs> to have <Chicago> <laughs> yeah, song. yeah. Wow. Well, let me come to Aban. So Aban, I mean. As you said, it's not easy. I know you are also doing your own thing, doing your best to make sure you have the best for yourself That's in the right. industry. That's right. So at the moment, apart from this particular project you all are working on, yep. what's up with you? What are you doing? Yeah, I also have a, a new single out there. Okay. Um, the, the audio is out there already, but the video will be out, um, I think, on the 14th of February. Mm. Yeah, uh, that's supposed to be the Valentine's Day. Ooh. Yeah, the title is Tease. You know, so the video, uh, the song is out there already. You guys can go check them out on all music streaming platforms. But the video will be out on the 14th of February. Okay. So apart from this, uh, the Truth Project, um, I still have something out there. The Steez for my people there, you know what I'm saying? Hmm. Straight. That's good to hear. Now let's talk about the Truth Project. Yeah. What is it all about? The Truth, I mean, um, it's high time the ghetto youth, you know, come together and, you know, uh, come together to have an uprising that you know it's really going to help us the get to you ourselves you know when we say the get to you should rise up doesn't mean we should rise up with cutlasses and guns and all those things no but we just have to speak to power you know because if you don't speak for yourself nobody knows uh, what's going on with you you know so uh, it's all about speaking the truth to power so that um, everything that uh, we're fighting for as ghetto youths must come to, to, to pass. Hmm. Yeah. Rena, how does it feel to be part of this project? You're, you're, you're four on this project and uh, I'm sure there's definitely something that actually attracted you to be part of it. Um, I think the number one thing is hearing that it's a reggae song. Hmm. I'm, every, everybody who knows me knows how much I love reggae, so hearing the tune, I feel like, yeah. And then, um, whoever put us on the song is, is, is not a joke. Deportee is not a joke thing. So he calling me by himself meant too much to me that I, I don't have to say no to it. And also this song is talking about issues happening in the world, you know, um, hardship that people are going through. And just as my, my brother said, um, it's hard time for all of us to rise up in our minds and not with cutlasses and then, you know, doing the, the not to be done but just ri rising up through our voices and the power that we have through music and then telling people how to you know um, go about things and doing just doing the right thing yeah wow so i find myself in nima and i'm sitting with two of should i say ghana's hottest people at the moment Deporti rashid metal this is their hood and so i had to just come here to come and do this Deporti. Right. how now we did fine now. <laughs> <laughs> and I know Rashid Metal, but you see, with these powerhouses, there's a lot to share, but uh, at the right time, we'll definitely do that because right now we're talking about a beautiful project that they have work, they've worked on and they want the world to know about it and how best we can help everybody to be part of this project. I know you probably you're the one who spearheaded this project. Yeah. Um, why did you decide to put the project together? I decided to put together and uh, the, the project together because of the hardship that is going on you can see a lot of things that maybe is going on in the system and i think music is very powerful and i think there are there are big artists they need to speak about it but they are not doing it so i feel like no this is this is the thing and we need to speak about it we need to speak about it so that the leaders at least it should go down well with them the, the masses need to listen to it so that they know that okay then you know the system we need to change it because People are suffering. A lot of people are complaining. People are angry. They can't come out and speak. People are married. They can't take care of their families. Mm. They can't pay fees. They can't do one or two. It's hard. Mm. So I feel like, no, let's put this thing together. And I call on Rashid Metal. I call on uh, Aban, uh, Reina, and there's a boy. There's another guy called Evidence. Mm. I call on them, and I feel like, no, we need to put this project together. So that's why we do that. Hmm. How did you choose these people? Because ideally, somebody go like, oh, why would you go for that artist or that one? But you chose these particular ones. Yeah, because there's, there's a particular talent in them, and I, I feel like Ghanaians needs to like listen to the other side of them. Mm -hmm. And I think they need it because there are a lot of people in, in this industry. People know them, but they don't give them eye just yeah. because they are not there yet. Mm -hmm. But somebody like me, when I identify talent, I feel like no, this is it. Ghana needs to Ghana need to listen to these people. Mm -hmm. So that's why I, I took it on me. I feel like no, Aban. 
Rashid Metal is, is, is out there already. Aban is out there. Reyna, she's doing wonderful. I think maybe evidence, a lot of people didn't hear him that much. Yeah. But I feel like, no, it's talent. So I need to put them together to do that project. And that's why I put them together. And it's out. Then How's it's it out. doing so you much know, so it's, far? It's like the response is great. Like, I was shocked the way currently we are getting in here, uh, getting calls from our, our outside Ghana. People were saying that, no, this project needs to like go out there. And currently we are working on one or two to like maybe to the BBC and then w, uh, DWTV for them to like maybe give us give a us platform. Yeah, a platform on it. Yeah, so okay. because it's a big, it's not it's not only about Ghana, it's about Africa. Mm. The problem that we are facing, we have bad leaders. That's our problem. Mm. All right, yeah. let me go straight to Rashid. Rashid, where have you been? This story. Where have you been? I've been around. You've been around. Yeah, I've been around. It's been so long. I <laughs> yes, bet yes, I will yes. not be the f the only one asking this question if yeah, I meet you. Yeah, I know, you. right? I know, right? Yeah, mm. I've, I've 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 been working on some projects. Yeah, and you know, like we, we said, music music is not something we have to rush because music is is a, is a lifetime something. You understand? So mm. I'm just putting up uh, works. Mm. Yeah, I'm putting up some works. I feel I feel honored. You know because. It's true. I am um, already. I have that same project also. So when I when I had the call from Dipoti and he 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 told me the the concept about the whole thing, I was like yes, because already I have certain things in my heart which I wanted to point out because things are not going on well, you know. And as an artist, the only weapon that I have is my voice and the microphone. You understand? Using the guns and the cutlasses, I don't think that's not the right way to go. So you know, I feel like. As, a, as an artist, I have to be the voice of the voiceless to speak. Maybe I don't have the right means to, you know, reach to, you know, the, the big-headed people. But through my voice and the music, I think it will, I will send the message through the music and it will get to them. Mm. How has the response been so far for you? My, like like the, the response, um, very amazing. Because, yes, you know, I, like I said, people wanted to say a lot about like how the things or how the, the economy the on. economies is going but they don't have the ways and the means to you know even if they speak how many people are going to you know listen, you, listen, you understand so as an artist i have to you know pour my heart, heart out, out. Uh, yeah. okay mm. all right and then working with the other artists i mean reina aban evidence of course deporty how was the experience like they, you know they, they are great talent so <laughs> there's nothing new about those people like we know them already you understand and somebody like Deporty, if you are not talent i don't think he you put you, you understand <laughs> yes so you know like my they are my, they are family you know and everybody did his or her part on the song yeah okay. all right mm. um let me come back to Deporty. so Deporty, now that you have actually put this project together which mm. is out there doing mm. amazing mm. um after this what next uh, after this, watch out for a lot of things because we are just praying for long life and, and, and prosperity. That's the only thing that I'm praying for. Trust me, because I think there are a lot of talent that Ghana needs to hear them. But I think people, people like, I, I keep saying this, whatever that you are doing, people are watching you, but they will do like they didn't see you. Mm. They want you to like maybe just grow and reach some place. And they, I, excuse me, say, I call them so-called industry players. Now they will try and see that they want to give you a, 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 a helping hand, but trust me, they are trying to milk you because what the time that you are in need, they will never mind you. Yeah. And then trust me, I, I thank I thank I thank you guys, uh, join news. If I any time that I, I have a project, if I call on you guys, trust me, the way you show me the love, I I, I really appreciate because a big a big platform like join news to give you a platform like this is not a joke. So I think every Ghanaian uh, every Ghanaian media or every Ghanaian, whoever that is pushing the music, they need to help. Mm. Not necessarily for, for you to like maybe, they want to see you up there before they are trying to do like, they want to help. Mm. Because there are a bunch of talents. Yeah. And the rotation of our media, or the rotation of our radio station, and maybe club pubs and everything, it's, it's been one way. Yeah. I think they need to like give everybody here. We have different kind of genres in this country, but every time we are giving... One. Charlie, so it makes the other, the other artists are struggling. Mm. Whereby they have the talent, but it's hard for them to be out there. So I think we need to like, we need to embrace everybody. Mm. It's a, it's a, there's a big market for everybody. So of course, all of us is. can eat. Yeah. yeah. Of course, there's a big market for everybody. Mm. I mean, I heard, I've heard uh, Rainer's part. 
I've heard Aban's part. It wouldn't be bad to hear your part as well. <laughs> <laughs> or just something small. No, no, I mean my part. My uh, part, I just speak something small in the song. Okay. Do you get me? I didn't, I didn't say I did, I did the intro and outro. Okay. I did it overhead, but I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't something like maybe. <laughs> That's DJ Khalid there. <laughs> You know, okay. No, we're trying to, we're trying to, we're trying to let let the people know that okay, then this is the talent. Yeah. Sometimes I just did it because I want to put them out there. Yeah. People need to see them. But if I said, oh, maybe let let them do it. Mm. Maybe they are out there already. But people say, hey, Charlie Deepoti is doing something. Let's go and watch who is Deepoti. Yeah. So from there, maybe they will see them. They will see them. So that's the idea. Okay. So maybe Rashid Metal is here. Uh, maybe do Rashid it. can do it. You have a lovely voice. You can do it for me. <laughs> See if you try it, maybe, maybe, maybe me say I go collect and do some remix for you right now. <laughs> yes. Yeah. They only know how to spend our money. They will come on TV, tell us what a cool story. Them belly food, they know they think about it. Tell me you are causing us pain and you think it is funny. Oh, None of them they feel our pain. What is happening? No less is going to eat a vein. Pressure the postman, they give him my pain. Watch it, they don't know Rashid Metal is talking. Mad. Yep. Rashid, mm. do you still have your movement in place? Is this still ongoing? You are more like the Sean Paul of, you know. Yes, you know, um, I, I have a new video out which is special. Mm. And you know, when people hear that song, they'll be like, Rashid, is, is that you or your, your godfather? You, you, you know what I mean? You know, I still have the voice, you know, and what? trust me, my new album, like, I don't know what to say, but like what the party said, we just need, you know, the media. You know, we can't do without the media, you understand? The media, the people should just watch out for a shit matter, you know? Okay. So I have a great album coming up. When the album is ready, just holler. We Mi got you. Miss Doreen, you know, you know me than you, dear. Yeah, just that just you, you, dog, you dog your brother, oh, you know? Oh, I did give you, I did give you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're all looking forward to We just want to have equal rights for all of you. Definitely, and so definitely. when the album is ready, just like your colleagues yes, are doing, yes, sure. just make sure you link us and then Most definitely. we'll definitely let it happen. And join us, we really appreciate you guys. Mm. Mm. All right. Deepot, is there anything you'd like to say so we can quickly wrap up? Yeah. I say we, 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 we only have one flag. In Ghana, yeah. that's the red, go green. The red, go green. That's the only flag that we know. Yeah. We don't know any NDC flag or mm. any MPP flag. Mm. Both politicians, other other political parties. I think this is the time for them to fight for Ghana, mm. not for themselves. Yeah. Not to come and eat and left the the masses hungry. Because mm. trust me, like the way this country is going, if care is not taken, mm. If care is not taken, trust me, some of us are on the streets and we know what is going on. Mm. If care is not taken, trust me, anything can happen in this country. And we don't pray for that. Mm. So that's why we are trying to conscientize the people, even the politicians and our people, for we to come together mm. and make sure that we can, we can put pressure on them so that maybe they will change this country for us. It's high time they should stop. I think the constitution is backing the polit politicians too mm. much. Mm. I think this is a time that the politicians, they need to amend some of the constitution and trying to like maybe Charlie with the sofa hmm. with the sofa recently I go pay fees and books and one or two Charlie it be hard hey rent then things food actually the way the country they go if care is not taken I swear I swear Charlie I don't want to talk too much you know Really? Well, talk too much, you it's know? all about the truth, and you have heard him. Deportee has said it. Rashid Metal has said it. Yeah, Aban has said it. Reina has also said it, and mm. uh, that's all we're looking for mm. too. So, if you haven't checked out the song yet, it's already out. It's on YouTube. Yeah, Go man. check it out. Go stream it. Share the word. Uh, let them know what you are feeling. There are a lot of people who have so much to say, but mm. are not able mm. or do not mm. have the platform mm. to mm. do it. They mm. have said it. Mm. And that's why we're also here to hear their cries and share with you right here on the Join News channel. True. Of course, um, I'd like to say thank you to all of you. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you, thank so, you so much. much. And yeah. I know that we'll definitely meet again. But when the project starts individually, Always look out for us and Trust we'll definitely yeah, be man. here for you. Yeah, man, yeah, man. All yeah, right. Man, man. Salud. Yep, I've been doing this right here in Nima. You never know what will bring me here again, but I know I'll come back again. Oh, definitely. I'll bring you here. <laughs> you can come here. I could hear you know.